Yes, I am on the throne. <laughs> bye bye, food. You know what they say now that I emptied out the system. I gotta re uh, rejuvenate. So we're gonna be going out to eat. It's, you know, Saturday night. Normally it's prime rib night for the eight father. Um, yes, I can still go to Cafferty's. <laughs> I'm not sure I'm gonna go there though, but. Um, I know people are like, hey, Father, you went nuts that night that you got drunk. Are you allowed back there? I got a few people asking that. Yeah, I'm, I'm allowed back there. Listen, what do you think? That I'm the only drunk they ever dealt with? <laughs> we think they deal with like 100 people like me a night. What are you talking about? They told me, they actually told me, they listen, you're drunk. At least you throw me a $100 tip. I threw the bartender a $100 tip. You know what I mean? So they, uh, they forgave me real quick when I showed them the Benjamin. You, the, actually, that's my uh, my advice to anybody. If you make a fool out of yourself and you make a jackass out of yourself and you get drunk in a bar, tip the bartender very, very good. <laughs> and uh, all is going to be forgiven. So anyway, we're about to go out. Definitely going to get some sort of steak. Prime rib, porterhouse steak, maybe Outbacks. I'm not sure yet. It's definitely going to be some uh, steak. Did you say steak? Remember Deuce Bigelow? He walked in, he saw that big, huge, gigantic woman on the bed, and she was like, and like so happy because he was like a male escort. She's like, mmm, mmm. And he walked in, he goes, I think I made a mistake. She said, Did you say steak? 